Welcome everybody. It is Crypto Moose and we're going to get loose. Mitchell Bouchard, your crypto and NFT investor. So what we're going to do on this episode is show you step by step how to add Cardano native tokens. Um, for that matter, we're going to show you how to add tokens in general. So if you guys do get something out of this, smash a like button, subscribe and comment whatever questions you have regarding cryptos and NFTs. And if you want, if you have any other tutorial ideas um, for the near future, for Tangem, whatever it may be, um, comment that down below. So right now we are July 21st, 2024. Um, I think a bull run's probably in, imminent. Um, so that is happening while the Tangem ring is also available. So if you guys want, you can use the link tree, click on Tangem wallet by here. So once you do that, You'll see this link and you can pre-order whatever Tangem wallet or rings that you want. Um, use code Moose though. So get Tangem, use code Moose. This will save you 10% off. So you can save up to 25% off all wallets except for the Trezors. I guess there's no discount for that. Just so you guys know. Um, I thought there was, but there isn't. Um, but anyways, use a link tree that will help you get situated. So without further to do, Let's get things situated on my phone. So I'm gonna do this in real time. So I've got my iPhone set up and I got my Tangem wallet. And if you guys have not set up your Tangem yet, let me show you guys how you can do that. You can go to the channel, go here, type in Tangem. And I have a setup guide. So full setup guide, very simple and easy to do. And I have how to send so if you guys want to know how to send some EDA to your address, I have a step-by-step -step tutorial right here for you. So it's some of the top videos um, on my channel even, okay? So that's how you're going to do that. So once you update the software, I recommend to open up Tangem Wallet. So you're going to open up the wallet, and then from there, you're going to scan your card. So let's do that. And what I'm going to do is switch back and forth to hide some code stuff. So once you enter your code, then you scan once again. So just like that. All right, so here in my wallet, we can see that we've got different assets. We got some Bitcoin, um, like $3 worth. We have a little bit of Tether, and then we have some Solana, some, I guess not much else. We have a bit of Kopi on the Binance Smart Chain, but now you can add Kopi on Cardano's chain with this wallet. So if you have a Tangem, you can now hold your EDA with your Tangem wallet. So your 12 word recovery seed phrases on this, you can now set it up that way. So what you're gonna do is go to manage tokens, okay? Manage tokens. Let's say you wanna add some Iagon, type in IAG, okay? And you're gonna go to the drop down and add Iagon for Cardano. Okay, you can also add the ERC20 version, which is Ethereum. But let's say for Cardano specifically, save changes. Now, if you go to Iagon, you can go to receive. And this will be your Cardano wallet. So 2CDH, that's what it ends in. If we go to ADA, should be the same, right? 2CHDH, okay? Let's say that you want to add some Kopi on the Cardano chain. So go to manage tokens, type in Kopi or Cornucopias, and go to the drop down and make sure that's checked on. Um, if you have some Kopi on base, you can click on that as well and save. So let's say we want to add all of our Kopi, meaning adding Kopi to be seen and available and supported on you know Ethereum, BNB, Cardano base, hit save changes, boom. So now if we scroll down, we can see these different copies with the layer one um, supported chain. So now when we scroll down, we can see cornucopias on different chains and you can see your balance and you have the little logo. So this I know is Ethereum. So this will be an ERC20 and then you'll have ADA, base, whatever other ones are supported. Another good one will be world mobile token. So you can go here, hit drop down, add WMT with Cardano. You can also add it on Ethereum, whatever you want, okay? 
So once you do that, then what you can do is swap and pick up some of the tokens. Uh, you're most likely going to have to get ADA first and then swap. So we can take a quick look here. So if we go to Tether, let's do a swap. So for Tether, we have to use um, TRX for the transaction. But let's see what we can pick up directly. We could pick up Kopi on BNB. But here it shows that we cannot pick up Kopi on the other chains um, using Tether. So with some assets you can, Bitcoin you might be able to, etc. Okay, so it depends on which assets you have. You can also easily swap. Um, just click on the asset that you added. Let's say Kopi on ADA. Click receive and send your Kopi to this address and it will now be stored and protected using cold storage using the Tangium. So that is how you add Cardano native tokens to your Tangium wallet. And maybe down the road, there will be more tokens on chain that will be supported as well. So if you guys want, go to the link tree. If you want to support the channel, we have tons of links for you, specifically for the Tangium. You can pre-order the Tangium ring. So we have those, we have NFTs, we have online courses, and follow us on other social media platforms. Comment down below what other tutorials you would love to see here on the channel. So with that being said, the moose is loose. We'll see you in the next one.